of God. I went to the police. They said Daniel bailed you out after the blackout. So I came here. I figured you'd be here across the street. You shouldn't be here, Declan. Why? What happened to you? I told her everything. How you freaked out and shoved me to the street when I said you weren't good enough for her. Well, wait, you, you told her that I did that to you? You're completely psychotic. Look at his hand. Look, Charlotte. Oh, God, I, I told you. This is, I, I got this trying to bust out of the ATM vestibule that we were in. That must have been when he stole the bail money. What are you talking about? I didn't steal a thing from you. Check his pockets. Yeah, you know what? Oh, my God. Wow. Can we get some help here, please? She is lying. I will take that. Take Thank you. We got a problem, young man? No, there's no problem. She's... The... Yeah, all right. Let's go. In that you don't have one. So imagine my confusion when you have the audacity to show up here after everything you've done. That's what I want to talk to Charlotte about. This new friend of hers, Regina, I don't know how she got those bruises, but I would never do something like that. And it's just that Charlotte believes everything she says, like she casts some kind of spell on her. It isn't a spell, Declan. She's pregnant. She's what? Oh, I see she hasn't told you. And for good reason. There's got, there's got to be a mistake. Oh, there is, and I am done looking at it. Stay the hell away from my daughter, or your ability to procreate will be nothing but a distant memory. Hello? Charlotte, would you please just listen to me? I swear to you, I never laid a finger on Regina. She, she faked those bruises, and, and I didn't take any money either. She must have planted it on me. And why would she do that? Because she's in love with you, or obsessed. Or I, just listen to me. Check her phone. She's got that, that internet video of you two kissing downloaded like some stalker. But you know what? I don't even know why I'm talking about that. Your mother told me about the baby. My mother? You know what? I think it's great. I just want to see you. I mean, if you would just tell security to, to, to let me into the press conference. I'm not even there right now. Are I'm... you with Regina? No, 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 no. I'm, I'm with Daniel. Where? Hello? Hopper's on standby. So, uh, are you all right? I'm fine. I just want to go home. OK. Watch your back. Declan! Right, clear the way now. Come through. Move out, please. Oh, God! Declan! Oh, my God! Is he going to be okay? Oh, God! Declan! What were you doing in there? Declan, I am so sorry. I never should have listened to Regina. None of this would have happened. No, 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 no. It's not your fault. I'm just... I can't believe you waited out there all night. Well, doctors wouldn't tell me anything. I was sick with worry. You know what they say? I'm gonna be fine. Thank God. I cannot face all of this without you. You are stronger than you think, Charlotte. I need you to believe that. After all, with us as parents, the kid's gonna be a handful, isn't he? Are you sure that's what you want? So are you. You're gonna be a great mother. Based on what? I have the worst role models in parental history. You know exactly what not to do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's what I wanted to see. Go home and get some rest. If not for yourself, then at least for the baby. By the time you see me next, I'm going to be as good as new. <laughs>